Miss Milagro. Hello, Miss Milagro. Hola, Milagro, ¿qué tal? ¿Cómo está? ¿Me escucha, Milagro? Hola, ¿me escucha? Good evening, Miss. Do you listen to me? Yes, I do. Good evening. Okay, thank you. I was trying to check out if the audio was okay. Okay. Thank you. So how was your day, Miss Heidi? It was nice. Okay. Yeah, okay. Working. Working. Yeah. Working a lot. Oh, yeah. Okay. Great. Hola. Buenas noches. Good evening. Me Good estoy evening. conectando por el teléfono porque mi computadora se le ocurrió estar haciendo update. No sé si logran ver. Mm. Cuando termine el update me voy a pasar a la computadora. Pero okay. Aquí. Yeah, but no problem. Is that's okay? Okay. Great. Ah, permítame. Creo que ya. Vamos a ver. Okay.
Me? Okay. Yes. I need to tell you that I have some problem with with homework 15. I, okay. I guess I'm, ya la vi yo también, I razón. guess I'm writing the right answer, but okay. Tell me because if there is a problem in the in the uh -huh. platform, I'm going to to tell to the administration so they okay. can help you. Because this exercise don't... number two. Okay, homework 15. Uh-huh. Uh, yesterday. Okay. Homework. I didn't see the instruction. Okay. Homework 15 and exercise number two. Exercise number two. Mm -hmm. Okay. What is the problem? The problem is that I think I'm writing the right answer, but it doesn't accept the right answer. Okay. The rest are okay. Only the second one. But there is there. There were no instructions. I don't know. No instructions. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Uh, I suppose that's why I I wrote the uh, the okay. post. There is no instruction at all. Uh -huh. There are no instructions. Okay, I'm going to talk to the administration. Okay. Okay. Okay, I'm going to call the attendance because it is the time, right? Whether you are or not. Ada Susena is not here. Ana Claudia. Here, teacher. Thank you. Andres Alberto, not yet. Cesar Humberto, not yet. Fatima, not yet. Francis, not yet. I don't know what happened today because they are always early, right? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Freddy is David. He said he's at work. Heidi. Here, miss. Thank you. Hugo, not yet. Karen, not yet. Liliana Melissa is here also. Lorena. Está raro que está a ah, Milagro. Milagro, María Milagro Rosales. Hola. Milagro tiene que contestar la asistencia. Ah, Mauricio Alberto. Hola, hola, hola. Ah, sí está aquí. Bien. Patricia Janet, Carolina, Sandra Carolina, Verónica, Wendy, Sochil, en Yolanda. Bien raro que hoy no, no se hayan conectado ni Melissa. Sí, está extraña la situación. Ok, later on they are going to get connected. So, thank you for telling me. Gracias por decirme del problema en el, en el homework 15 para hacerles saber a la administración para que les puedan ayudar, ¿verdad? Mañana yo lo voy a reportar. Okay. Entonces quedamos que es el ejercicio número dos, el que les da problema. Y no hay instrucciones, me dicen. ¿De acuerdo? Ok, perfecto. So let's get started. And you know that tomorrow we are finishing week number three. Yes, and only one more week. Una semana más y se termina y ya estarán en el nivel cinco. Así es que eh, a seguir trabajando en la plataforma, ¿verdad? Mm -hmm. Y con la asistencia también para que haya un final feliz. Okay, so we are going to begin with the feedback. Okay, I'm going to share my screen. And hello, Miss Liliana Melissa, welcome. Hi, good evening. How are you today? I'm tired, I'm doing home office, so. Oh, really? It's harder because I have to do my work and the things of, of the of the house and clean and cook and everything. Yes, I know. 
because I am doing home office too. <laughs> so well, it is harder than to be. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. At this time, I'm done. I'm dying. Okay. So, yeah, it's hard. You are, a, but you're a survivor. Yeah, totally. <laughs> okay. So I am going to share my screen with you and we're going to get started. Okay. So here we go. Mm -hmm. This is our video conference for team. So I need somebody to help me reading the agenda. Who wants to read the agenda today? Only one volunteer. <laughs> me, miss. Yes, please. Okay, agenda, sharing agenda number one, number two, objective, number three, feedback, number four, warm up, number five, simple past information questions, and number six, wrap up. Okay, thank you, Miss. And now we have the general objective. Another volunteer to read the general objective, please. Me. <laughs> please. Okay, A students will develop competencies that will allow them to describe features of products, describe processes and processes about selling or buying online, know customers' opinions towards products they sell, and have conversations with others about financial activities. Thank you so much. So that is for the whole module. Now the class objective. Ms. Uh, Melissa, continue, please. Oh, okay. Participants will be able to ask customers details about a problem they had to provide a solution. Very well. Okay, so this is what we are going to be discussing today in your module. And now we have here the feedback. We are going to work as a class. And in order to review what we did yesterday, we are going to read and complete these sentences. If I ask you, what do you remember about the previous class? Okay, so you can use three uh, stem of sentences in order to share with the class, okay? So who wants to start? Me, um, I remember in the previous class, we practiced past tense of regular and irregular verbs. Very well. Miss Melissa? Also, I remember that we practiced uh, did, the sentences with did, no, the que make questions with did and answering using the same did or didn't. With the auxiliary did, yes? Yes, the past tense. Miss Ana Claudia. Yes, teacher. Do you hear me? I don't know. If yes, Miss. Perfectly. Ah, okay, Perfectly. Thank you. Uh, yes, what I remember is that we been making questions using the structure, structure using the auxiliary did. And we've been using as a guidance the short answers in positive or negative way. Okay, very well, thank you so much. And today, uh, the objective of this warm up activity is to get the students into the mood of being instructed. Now you are going to work in a small groups and you are going to brainstorm about Further questions, you ask customers to get more information about a problem they have with your company, with something that they bought, but they are not satisfied. They are not happy. It can be with the service or with the product, okay? And later, you are going to share with the class. So, do you have any question about the activity you are going to be working with right now? No question? 
you are going to write a list of the possible questions, the questions that go beyond in order to research, to investigate, okay? From the customer, in order to get more information about a problem that they have when they call, yes, to complain. So here we go. I'm going to stop sharing the screen. And let me see, Caroline, welcome. Hello, Caroline. Caroline, do you listen to me? I don't know if she is available. Hello, Fatima. Fatima, do you listen to me? Yes, teacher. Okay, so there is no problems with the audio. Carolina? Sandra Carolina? Carolina? Carol, ah, Yolanda is here. Okay, in order to create the groups, remember that it is the system, the one that creates the groups. Okay, so I'm going to create one, two, three, so far. Three groups, okay, automatically, and you have that activity in your module, okay? The one that you are going to perform right now. La actividad que van a realizar en este momento la tienen ahí en su manual de INSAFOR. De ahí lo he tomado como antecedente. Today we are going to work on pages 35 and 36. Vamos a trabajar las páginas 35 y 36, ¿de acuerdo? Okay, so here we go. When the other partners arrive, you're going to have more participants. Now let's begin. Okay. Go to your breakout rooms. Okay. Milagro, you are going to work with uh, in group number two. Caroline, Caroline, Carolina, Carolina, está conectada o tiene problemas con el audio, Carol. Carolina le toca trabajar en el equipo uno. Carolina, se quedó congelada la imagen. Ok. ¿Al qué me dijo? Ah, el al great. Les estoy poniendo, fíjese. Quiero saber por qué. A ver, no me haga, pero bueno. Entonces tenemos que hacer un listado ¿va? de actividades, de, de preguntas. Vamos a ver. Yo sé que hace con la al dos. Sí, fíjese que lo que pasa es que quizá eh, la voy a después de la clase, ni modo, la voy a, a reiniciar porque no, no me... Voy a reiniciar porque es bien raro. Mire, entonces, ¿qué es lo que hay que hacer en actividad? Hay que hacer un listado de los yes. complaints. Yeah. Okay. The possible questions that you ask to the customer. Hola, Ana Claudia. To research, ¿ok? Ok. And what Hola. the problem when, is, to make sure the what, the, what the problem, the problem. is. problem. Yeah. Uh -huh. So you can help them. Okay. Okay. I cannot hear you, Yolanda. Creo que tiene problemas con el audio, Yolanda. 
Yolanda? In that, in that moment. So in my case, for example, if, if, if the customer had a problem with my product, the one, one of the questions that I do is about the flavor of the product. If, it, if he feels a different flavor in the product, um, and probably say yes or no, then I, I, for example, can ask about the seal of the bottle. If it was, uh, if it was sealed, or if the bottle was open, or 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 something that is not. Peter, how do you, how do I say confiable, reliable? Okay, so if the sealer, if the, if the uh huh, if the package is reliable, if the package if is reliable, okay. yeah. Okay, so that's another question that I can do. And, and if they answer that they have a big problem with the product, it's not the same flavor, it's not the usually presentation that they receive, I, I ask to send me the presentation and I send it to the laboratory to analyze the product. But the common questions that I can do is, if the flavor is different, if the package is reliable, and, and that, those two. What about you, Milagro? Ay, mi amor, yo no entiendo nada de esto. <laughs> ¿Qué, ¿Qué puedo hacer? O sea... No, 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 no entiendo. O sea, me conecté hoy pues para hacer acto de presencia y ver cómo trabajan, pero realmente no, no sé ni qué hago aquí. Ay, Dios mío. Creo que regresaré al nivel uno. No, Melissa. La teacher la puso ah, mal conmigo. Es que yo no los pongo, los pone el sistema. Ah, ¿en serio? Sí. Ahí van automáticamente. Pero ya se quedan ahí por, digamos, por la clase, ¿verdad? El siguiente ah. día es otra vez, ¿sí? Eh, lo que estamos haciendo, sí, lo que estamos haciendo acá, Milagro, es que... Eh, como es un seguimiento, ¿verdad?, de todo lo que han estado viendo, es que están tratando de hacer un listado de un caso uh, hipotético en el cual su compañía ha vendido un producto, pero el cliente no está satisfecho. Entonces, usted como representante de la compañía, ¿qué tipo de preguntas le haría a ese cliente para averiguar, para indagar más cuál es el problema que, que tiene para poder solventarlo, ¿verdad? Porque él ya compró un producto, probablemente no se siente satisfecho con el producto o con el servicio, ¿sí? Okay. Es algo parecido como a las encuestas de, de satisfacción, que a veces nos hacen por teléfono, incluso en el cam pollo campero. Uh, en el ticket le dicen, llene esta encuesta, por favor. ¿Verdad? Entonces, ese, ¿qué tipo de preguntas le haría usted a un cliente para saber cuál es el problema que tiene con el producto? En el, en el caso de Melissa, como ella trabaja con una compañía que distribuye licores, licores, ¿verdad? Entonces, the seal, the seal, el sello es bien importante. Que venga sellado el producto. So it cannot be mixed or altered o alterado. So that's why she was saying, por eso ella estaba diciendo, eh, I would ask if the seal is closed. Yo preguntaría si el sello de la botella va cerrado. Because if it is open, you cannot buy it. 
especially in the conditions that the world is now because of the pandemic, right? It is a risk. Um, that is uh, on her point, but what about you? Where do you work? Donde trabaja usted? Eh, Milagro? Mm -hmm. en, en mi panadería. Okay, so you, you run your own business. Usted tiene su propio negocio. Yeah. Okay, it is even like more important for you because you are the, the owner. So if a customer, a client is not satisfied with the product, what do you do? What do you ask him or her in order to identify what is the problem? Si usted mira que como que no le gustó algo al cliente, ¿cómo hace? ¿Qué le pregunta para averiguar cuál es el problema? In order to improve, obviously. Para mejorar, obviamente. ¿Ok? Uh -huh. Bueno, yo le preguntaría si, si no le están atendiendo bien. Si no, si no le están llevando a tiempo el producto. Entonces, en su panadería tienen delivery. Sí. Ok, no llegan los clientes a la panadería. No. Ah, ok, so it would be delivery, right? Delivery service. To ask about the delivery service. Delivery service satisfaction, yes? Esa sería su primera idea. Delivery service satisfaction. Ok, what else? ¿Qué más podríamos ahí? Aparte del servicio. Maybe um, a, um, about the prices, los precios, porque a veces la competencia como que los pone más baratos, ¿verdad? <laughs> sí, entonces ahí dice, ay, no es que mira, que no sé qué. Entonces, if the price is okay, if the price is okay, si el precio está bien, if the price is acceptable. If the price is acceptable. Si el precio es aceptable. Ok. One more related ah, to. Yo, uh, yo uh, le preguntaría me... si se siente conforme con la presentación del producto. Ok. Do you like the product's presentation, right? Uh, sale, sale bien. Do you like. Do you like the product's presentation? Yeah. And uh, what about the flavor? El sabor? No, porque ellos ya conocen el producto. Pero okay. tal vez es cuestión de servicio, es lo que yo indagaría. Ok, customer service. Mm -hmm. If, um, do you feel probably comfortable, yes, or satisfied with the customer service? Yes, mm -hmm. do you feel, do you feel, uh, Satisfied, do you feel satisfied with the customer's service? Do you feel satisfied, se siente satisfecho, with the customer's service? Okay. So you see, we have four questions. Ya tiene cuatro preguntas. Sí. Okay. So you consider those are the most important in your, in your business. Yes. Esas serían las más, las más importantes en su negocio, ¿verdad? Sí. En su empresa. Okay, very well. So you have four questions in there. And now, uh, I don't know if you have something else to discuss. Tienen algo más que, que, que agregar? Uh, 
Melissa. I just added another question in my case that is, are you interested in a specific brand? Because um, sometimes they say just, I want a whiskey or we dare say just vodka or something like that. And, and they never got in, get back in mind what kind of brand he would like to buy. Ah, okay. Uh, lo que pregunta Melissa Milagro es uh, el nivel de satisfacción que tienen con el whisky, porque a veces hacen un pedido y no conocen la marca, ¿verdad? Y probablemente eso como imaginémonos whisky hay diferentes marcas, ¿ya? Y ahí podría ser el problema. I don't like uh, your whisky, but it is not that they don't like whisky. It is that they don't like the brand. Es que no les gusta la marca, ¿verdad? Mm -hmm. Okay. Yeah. Very good. So now we are going to go again to the main session room and we are going to share. Y ahora mm -hmm. vamos a compartir, okay? okay? With the group. Okay. Okay. Thank you. My Okay, now Ahí it is time. Ajá, uh -huh, Caroline. No, se quedó trabada la, el internet. No puede entrar y, y disculpe. Hay problemas de conexión. Sí, yo me quedé llamándole, llamándole y me imaginé que se había quedado frozen. Okay, so sí. now it is time for sharing your ideas. Okay, who wants to begin? ¿Quién quiere comenzar? Only one. Me teacher. Okay, please. Um, we have we have nine ideas with Claudia. So I'm going to read the the middle and Claudia um, read the another one. Okay. Okay. Okay, Yolanda. Okay, and for us, uh, we have the brainstorm, for example, number one. When did the problem start? Did you try to solve? Did you look at website for a possible solution? How long were you able to use the product? Did you have the invoice? Now, Claudia. Okay. And the, the rest are, would you bring the product? Would you bring the product to the warehouse? Uh, number seven, did you purchase an extended warranty? Would you like an exchange or a refund? And the last one, can I call you back at your number? One, two, three, four, five, six, nine, 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 nine. <laughs> okay, thank you. Okay. Somebody else? Alguien más? Me, teacher. Okay. In your case, in our case with Milagro, the questions are, if the seal is closed, did you taste a different flavor in the product? Um, uh, ask about delivery service satisfaction. If the price is acceptable, um, do you like the product presentation? Are you interested in a specific brand? And do you feel satisfied with the customer service? Okay, very well. Uh, do you feel satisfied with the customer service? Yeah, you mix the, the ideas, your ideas with Milagros ideas, okay? So very well. And uh, Miss Heidi and Miss Fatima. Fatima, Ms. maybe want to. Miss Fatima. Okay. What's the exactly the problem? Would I say the product the placement? How can we do you happen again? Who attended here before? 
Are you satisfied with the product you have received? Very well. <laughs> okay, good try. Now that you have that antecedent, ahora que ya tienen ese antecedente, vamos a trabajar y vamos a ver qué es lo que nos dice el manual. Okay, so everyone, please open your manual, please. And here we go. Let's see. Everyone at page 35. And we have that, if you notice, in exercise number one is what you have been discussing. Este ejercicio número uno es el que acabamos de realizar. De acuerdo? Now, in exercise number two, we are going to read the following email about a customer's problem. And when we analyze this, if you notice, obviously this email is in past tense because it is describing a situation that already passed, right? So we're going to work in a small groups and we are going to read this uh, email it is the subject is a complaint about a trip. El motivo, el asunto, una queja acerca de un viaje. Ya. Yeah? And later, we are going to ask a different partner these questions and write the answers. Okay. Are we clear? Yes. Okay. Very well. So here. Here we go. Okay. I'm going to stop sharing. Where are the others? They went away. Who's missing? Bueno, vamos a tener que hacer los cambios en los grupos porque uh, you are alone, eh, Miss Melissa, okay? And here we go. Carolina se desconectó, tal vez va a volver a ingresar. Entonces, Melissa, la vamos a enviar al equipo. Carolina está, ya se conectó, está en el room number one. Entonces, vamos a enviar a Liliana al grupo número 3. Okay. Move to room 3. Okay. Here we go. Let's go to the groups. Go to your groups. Carolina, you are in group number one. Carolina está en el equipo número uno. No sé qué. We have to read this. Who wants to start? I guess it would be important for us to everyone read. Yes. Okay, if you want to start. The idea okay. is that everyone reads aloud, okay? So you can have the practice of reading. Yeah. And then we need to uh, ask question. and answer the questions that are below the email, okay? Okay. Okay, <laughs> okay so to Peter T. Email.com. <laughs> to travel with your company to another country. But to be honest with you, it was a bad experience because the bus you assigned me in, in didn't have AC. It was a long trip and the bus was very slow. I'm considering not to travel, traveling with you again because of the inconvenience I had. Repite, hay que seguirlo leyendo o también hay que ir este 
resolviendo las preguntas. No, no, no. Cada quien tiene que leer en voz alta. Cada ah. uno tiene para que practiquen la lectura, ¿verdad? Okay. Ahorita entonces. Okay. Okay. Sí. Eh, Caroline tiene que leer unas tres veces. Eso. Vale. Perfecto. Ok, yes, because practice makes perfect, ok. Ok, yes. ok. Go okay. ahead, Caroline. Eh, Gmail.com. Eh, el subject is complain about the trip from eh, hazard.r at gmail.com. Last week, I had the chance to travel with your company to another country. But to be honest with you, it was a bad experience because the bus that you signed me in didn't have AC. It was a long trip and the bus was very slow. I'm considering not traveling with you again because of the inconvenience I have. So now we need to ask it. No, it's all out here. Huh? Who is here? Oh, where, where do you see? Because I'm over the phone, I don't know where do you see the participants. <laughs> no, I don't know. I'm in the computer. <laughs> ah, okay, I found the there right is Hugo. <laughs> so we need to ask. Hi. Hugo, we are in page number 35. 35. Okay. The exercise right now is read. The, the email what a bad experience the customer had. If you please and, want to read. And the read the folly email. Uh -huh. the, the exercise number two. I don't know if you are able to see here. Okay, okay. Mm -hmm. Solamente leer. Yes, read it. After that, we are going to make a question. Okay. I was answering yes, to your partners in the chat because Hello. they I was I was answering to your partners in the chat because they wrote something, but I was explaining and we were discussing, so I didn't want to to be rude to them, right? Without reading, but and right now I answer to them because I had a chance. Okay, so uh, remember that the idea here is that everyone reads, so you can practice pronunciation. And when you read and read, you understand the things better, yeah? Okay, yeah. Hugo, first, the activity is to read and read to practice pronunciation, and later you are going to answer the questions, okay? Okay, teacher. Great. Ooh. So go ahead, please read. Okay, <laughs> to, to Peter is, to Peter uh, at, arroba at, 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 at arroba you say at you say hat at arroba se dice at at ah, okay okay Peter at gmail dot com subject complete about a trip from Hazer, Hazer, dot air, hat, gmail, dot com. Last week, I had the chance to travel with your company to another country. But, but to be more honest with you, it, it was a bad experience because the bus that you assigned me, I didn't have a C. It was a long trip and the bus was very slow. I am considering not traveling with you again because of the convenience I had. Mm -hmm. 
And do we understand what is the problem here? The bus, it didn't have air conditioner. Correct. And also, the bus was very slow. The work was very slow. But to be honest with you, it was a bad experience because the bus you assigned me in didn't have air conditioning. It was a long trip and the bus was very slow. I'm considering not traveling with you again because of the inconvenience I have. Tu turno. Tu turno. A quien le toca? Tu turno, oui. Fatima. Oui. Hmm? Last week, I had the chance to travel with your company to another country, but to do my own with you is what I've experienced because the bus that you are seeing me in didn't have a seat. It was a long trip in the bus as well as was very slow. I am considered not traveling with you again because of the convenience I have. Okay. Last week, I had the chain to travel with your company to another country, but today, honestly, why you is why I had inspiration because the bus asked me in the not help I see. I was a long train and the bus was very slow. I am considered now traveling with you again because of the inconvenience I had. Finish. Finish. Okay. Get ready. Pero vamos a seguir. Otra vez. Did you okay. answer the questions? Did you answer the questions? Yes, we did. Okay, so uh, let's uh, give the chance again to Caroline. Yes, to read. And then we get back to the main, main session. Okay, Caroline, go ahead. Let's Otra vez, last week I had the chain to travel with your company to another country, but to be honest with you is as well as have inspiration because the bus that you asked in Maine did not have AC. It was a long trip and the bus was very slow. I am considered not traveling with you again because of the inconvenience I had. Finish, teacher. <laughs> okay, now that you have read that email, yeah, and probably we learned new words. You also um, answer the questions, yes? So, Hugo, Hugo. Hello, Hugo. Could you please Hello, read? Teacher. Could you please read question number one and say the name of the classmate who is going to answer the question? Okay, Lea teacher. la pregunta número uno y tiene que decir el nombre de quién lo va a contestar. ¿Ok? Ok, teacher. Please. Uh, where did the passenger go? Uh, Yolanda. Ok. Uh, the, passenger, the passenger went to another country. Okay, thank you. Fatima. Hello, Fatima. Now, question Hello, number teacher. two. Question number two. Read question number two and say the partner who is going to answer. Okay? Okay. We did the passenger consider is bad experience. Example. 
Ok. Ana Claudia. Ana Claudia. Ok. Eh, the passenger considered it, it a bad experience eh, because eh, the bus didn't have air conditioning and it was uh, very slow. Very good. But I think we have question number three, yes? Okay, Caroline, read question number three. What did the person say they ate in me? Okay, who is going what to answer, the Caroline? Say they ate? Perdón? ¿Quién va a contestar la pregunta? Um, eh, César? No, César is not here yet. You oh. have uh, Liliana Melissa, Heidi, uh -huh. Claudia, Yolanda, uh -huh. Hugo, Fátima. Hugo, Hugo. Okay. Question number three, Hugo. Do you have the answer? Okay, he is at work and he has an emergency at the moment. So, so ask someone else, Caroline. Pregúntele a alguien más, Carolina. Ahorita. Eh, quiero ver quién es de las compañeras porque no las he visto. Liliana Melissa, Heidi, Ana bueno, bueno. Claudia. Eh, Ay, se me olvidó un poquito la casa más eh, Heidi, entonces. Ok, Heidi. Ok. The passenger sent a complaint about the inconvenience that had during the trip. That they had during the trip. Very good. Ok. So, now I'm going to ask you. Did you ever had a problem similar to that one? Mm -hmm. ¿Alguna vez tuvieron un problema similar a ese? Mm -hmm. No, I haven't had any yes. problem. Yes? Okay. Yes. Sometimes those things happen. That the companies offer something, but mm -hmm. when you are in the, in the trip, the things are different, right? Yeah. Also with the hotels, when you look for a place uh, in the internet, yeah, the pictures are beautiful, yeah. but when you are in the place <laughs> and then the conflict starts. Okay, so here we go. And now that we have here, Last week, I had the chance to travel with your company to another country. But to be honest with you, it was a bad experience because the bus that you assigned me in didn't have AC. It was a long trip and the bus was very slow. I am considering not traveling with you again because of the inconvenience I had. So if you notice, it is very polite because instead of saying because of the problem or blah, 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 it mentions the inconvenience, right? They are, uh, this person is complaining, but is using polite language. So right now, what we're going to do is the following. You are going to write a short email similar to this one but you are going to describe a situation, a problem that you have, okay? Use your imagination in order to create that brief email. And later you are going to share with the class. Vamos a escribir en equipos un correo corto. Describing a problem you have. Describiendo un problema que eh, les ocurrió. Similar a este, pero ustedes hacen la adaptación. Y luego lo vamos a compartir en la clase. ¿Están claras las indicaciones? 
Yes. Okay. So now let's go back to the small rooms. Go to your groups. Fatima and Caroline. Fatima, you go to group number one, please. Fatima. Eh, bueno, lo voy a decir en español. Por, uh, se arruinó el aire acondicionado del bus. El calor desesperante fue el día martes cuando venía para Huachapán. No. Es que ese se parece al que leí. Entonces, se Pero quedó el bus. Y ponemos eso. O ponemos otro. Uh -huh. Como iba a decir, Milar, ¿verdad? Then podemos poner, I feel pretty upset about the fact. In the, it's not in the parking sun, but we have stopped the plane and we have to wait for about one and a half hour to get down off the plane. And go to, to be able to exit the plane or, or yeah, one and a half hour. Yeah. In order for you to leave the plane. So you were sit down one hour and a half. Yeah, uh, yeah. And it was like I think two or three a.m. So we were tired, we want to sleep, we couldn't because everybody wants to to leave the plane and you can't because the the plane is the I think it was because the plane hasn't a specific song to, to uh, park it. Uh -huh. I, I don't know. Uh -huh. <laughs> <laughs> but we have to wait that another plane leave the, the area and we can mm -hmm. park. <laughs> My goodness, like a car. Yeah. A car slot. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So I think that was just the one bad experience that I had, but. Not this and bad. Land? I don't know if you have another bad experience. So I, I didn't have a bad experience because one to one, uh, around five years ago, I have to travel to Panama, but but my trip is, was so so nice, right? Ah. I have no any inconvenience about something like that mm. it was nice. so only for example when i had to travel to sonsonate from san salvador yes um, uh, in one month one month one month ago i i had to travel to san salvador but i have to to get um, a bus that, that it is not a special, so it, ah, that, the regular that, ones. It's the regular one. So is uh, I have to travel around the 12th, 12th of noon. So it's uh -huh. the, it is it was very 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 horrible. So because uh -huh. uh, there is no anyone special bus, and I have to travel in in the regular bus. So. It was no air conditioning. No air conditioning. Was stop every five or ten minutes. Yes, yes, because the hour it, 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 it was the the hot hour, right? Ah, okay, okay. Yes. The higher. I think I don't know what you think, but I don't know if Hugo has. Do you have another an experience, Hugo, or? Because I, I would like to take the Liliana's experience to make the example for the email because it's, it's, yeah. Yeah. it's one hour and a half. Yeah, and, the, and the, the people that it was taking a connection flight, 
with that hour and a half, maybe they lose the, the connection. Wow, they lost the connection. I think that we can use your example to create an email. So okay. we can use the same, uh, the same, uh, for the example, to the uh -huh. same to Avianca, gmail com, something like that. Okay. Make the example. So is to Peter T at avianca.com? Yes. Okay. We can use the same. Okay. Uh, the subject the, the same complaint about flight. Uh -huh. I think we can change it for a for a flight. Complain about 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 a trip. It's it is the same thing. I don't know if when we say trip is because is using maybe a car or a bus. Mm, I don't know. I think they're going to use no because we can say complain about the recent flight. Complain about the recent flight. Yes. Mm -hmm. About a recent flight. And the hammer, we leave the from the same, right? Okay. From Liliana Roba Giver Puta. For the higher price. They ticket are more space because they offer a condition. Seria. They ticket the tickets are more space because they offer a condition. Podría ser así. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Sí, puede ser así, pero. Bye. Hasta ahí. Karen is going to join your group, okay? People, Karen is going to join your group. Okay. Welcome, Karen. Hi, Karen. Las, vale, lo voy a leer todo ya. Last Thursday, uh -huh. I feel really upset about good the good evening. Good evening. Yeah, awesome. The AC on the bus traveling to a wash up and board. Estamos haciendo un, un, ¿cómo se llama? Sí, un correo. Email. Email. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. About a complaint. About a complaint to a company. The, the company of the cost, additional of price. The ticket, the ticket are more special because they offer a condition. Así sería, ¿verdad? ¿Qué, mm -hmm. ¿Qué página Finish. están viendo? Eh, 25. 35. Treinta y cinco. Ok. Uh -huh. Estaban las haciendo la actividad de... uno. Oh, really? sí, sí, la uno y la dos. Sí, Karen. And send about okay. all the door. Okay. They don't keep and see and the bus travel. Karen, we are, we are writing an email to a company to complain about, about, about the price. The ticket. Okay. 
Le oigo como cortado, ah. Heidi. Y ahora. They are. Sí, ahora sí. More special because they are solar air conditioner. Um, ¿Quieres leerlo otra vez, Caroline? Eh, Last Thursday, I feel really upset about fall. The tea accident and they has traveling to a Japan this world. The company has the most bound additional of the play. They think there are more space because they offer a condition. Uh -huh. At the end, we can say, I'm a not recommending you because of the because of the inconvenience. What do you think? More expression. More expression. More expression. Hello. Because. Ese es el que hicieron ustedes. El, el correo. Uh -huh. Yes. Puede leerlo una vez más, por favor. Sí. Last two night I feel really upset about fall doing till I see a bus traveling to a wash up and did work. The company has their most comes additional on the price. The teacher are more expedition because they also out for air condition. Otra vez. Lo último. Repeat. Lo último. No le entendí lo que dijo. Lo último. Sí. Repítalo. The ticket Pero hable are, un poquito más duro. Que lo dejo lejos. The ticket are more expiration because they off air conditional. El. Oh. O todo. Uh -huh. Last Thursday, I feel really at head about fall, don't take accident. I see, I they bus the travel to a wash up and did work. The company also more come additional on the price. The tickets are more expiration, expiration because they offer a condition. Finish. Now we're going to get back to the main session room, okay, to share with the class. Yes. Okay. 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 Thank you. Okay, I am going to say your names. Who is missing? Fatima. Okay, because it is time for the second attendance. Ada, she had a surgery, she said. Ana Claudia. Ana Claudia. Oh, she's here. Hello, Ana Claudia. I am in the in the second checking of the attendance. Oh, hello. I'm here. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Andres. Was not in the cyberspace. <laughs> Cesar. Fatima. Present. Francis. Freddy is at work. Heidi. Here. Hugo. Hugo. I hate I teacher, I hate teacher. Okay, thank you, Karen Stephanie. Karen Stephanie. Here. Thank you. Liliana Melissa. Present. Lorena. 
María Milagros. Mene, esta cosa no es... Mauricio. Patri, eh, Patricia Janet. Sandra Carolina. Sandra Carolina. Sandra Carolina. Okay. Present, 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 teacher, present. <ríe> Verónica, Yesenia, Wendy. Wendy today is not connected. Sochil, Yolanda, Cristina. Present. Okay, very well. Now, people, please, I need volunteers. One representative from each group in order to read your mail, okay? Mm -hmm. Who's going to be the first one? Uh, the group is Heidi. I'm person. I don't know how to call it. Karen, Karen, Karen. 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 Fatima and Karen. And who is going to read it? Sorry, continue. Last tour, last tour that I feel really answered about how the fear I see I the bus traveling to our Japan did work. The company after moon comes additional on the price. The ticket are more expedition because they offer air conditioner. Okay, finish. And from the other group, who is going to read? Yolanda, Hugo, Ana Claudia, Liliana, if you want, I can read. If you want, I can read. Okay. Uh, do you hear me? Yes. Yes, clearly. Ah, okay. okay. Mm -hmm. It's a complaint about a fly. Uh, yesterday, I flew with uh, your company and it was a bad experience because we had to wait almost two hours to leave the plane. I lost my connection to Mexico because there was an allocated space for the place to land. I will never fly again with you. <laughs> okay, really, really upset because of that inconvenience, right? Yes. <laughs> okay, great. So now let's continue. And here we go. Okay, let's see. Now you are going to work again and let me see. Today is Thursday. Wendy, Wendy is not here. And Melissa, tomorrow after the class, you, I need you to stay with me 10 minutes, okay? According to okay. the calendar that the administration sent. Maybe Wendy is okay. going to join later on. I still have expectations. So here, uh, but we were working on that. Now you are going to work in a small groups and you are going to ask and answer the following questions. What did you eat last Holy Week? What did you eat last Holy Week, last year? Do you remember? Because of the pandemic, we were not able to go to the beach we were not able to go to, to the river, to travel to another country, to go to Guatemala, Honduras, okay? So we have to stay home. So what did you eat last Holy Week? That is the first question. Where did you use to go on vacations when you were a child? Where? did you use to go on vacations when you were a child? Letter C, what did you enjoy when you were a child? What did you enjoy when you were a child? Okay. And if you have chance, describe the last party you attended, but you did that already. So let's focus only in letter A, B, and C, okay? And share your experiences with the class. Okay. We're going to wait and maybe someone else is going to join because they have problems at work as far as I, they are sharing. So you tell me when we can go back 
to the breakout rooms, okay? Do you have any problem with the, with the three questions that you are going to be asking and answering? They are information questions, okay? So we are going to use the verbs in past tense. Okay. You tell me when we can continue. I don't know the rest, but okay. Yes, okay. Okay. Yes, we can continue. Okay, here we go. I'm going to open the breakout rooms, okay? Go to your groups, please, and share. Fatima is waiting for Caroline and Karen. And Anna Claudia, Liliana, and Yolanda are waiting for Hugo. Hugo, your group is number three. Hugo? Hugo, you go to group number three, please. Okay, great, thank you. Eh, la responde y luego Fátima le pregunta a Carolina y de ella a Heidi y de ella a mí. ¿Les parece bien? Yes. I used to go on my vacation um, to the beach. To the beach, ah, okay. And I used to go to my um, aunt, uh, to my aunt house, aunt house in Sosonate. Mm -hmm. Oh, really? Yes. I to well, I used to go to my grandma's house in Santa Ana. Oh, okay. <laughs> Nice. Welcome, Ada. Yeah, yeah. Thank you for being here. Hi, Ada. Hi. Hi, Ada. Okay, ask the questions to Ada, okay? Because she doesn't know the questions. But she can answer. Yeah, three questions about your activities, okay? Work, 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 and work. <laughs> <laughs> Okay. Ada, we have three questions. Maybe. Be... <laughs> <laughs> yes. Two. Okay. Where, di where, where did you used to go on vacation when you when you were a child? Fish, fish, and fish, fish, and torreja. No sé cómo se dice. Así la vamos a dejar. Rejas. Rejas. Esas cosas. Ah, ok, típica el food. 
typical food. Just ah, okay. And right now we are asking us where did you used to go on vacation when you were a child? To, vac to vacation? When you were a child, where did you used to go? Uh, Yolanda said the beach, Liliana, her grandmother's house, home in Santana, me, my uh, aunt's home in Sonsonate, and you? At home at my father. Work también. I am I no vacation. <laughs> ah, you have no vacation. Okay. And Hugo? Uh, I no have vacation. You either. People. Me too. I I <laughs> Remember, the question it says, where did you used to go on vacation when you were uh, Ale, uh, when you were a child? Cuando eras niño. Mm -hmm. Oh. Uh, uh, one, one occasion is a visit Guatemala. Mm -hmm. Uh, but if you are answering in in, in uh, the past tense, how how will be the the way this? Is? No, you can say when I was a child, I used to go visit Guatemala. Mm -hmm. Hola, hola. Hola, you can you can say when I was a child, I I used to go, I used to visit Guatemala. Mm -hmm. Ay, me because this is when you were a child. Okay. Microphone, Ada. Ada, do you hear us? Yes, aquí estoy. Ah, uh -huh, vaya. Entonces, where did you used to go on vacation when you were a child? Only grandfather and San Miguel. Grandfather, I used have to say, but you have to say, when I was a child, I went to my father's house. Uh -huh. My grandfather. Grandfather. You have to use the, the, the verb in past tense. Mm -hmm. So you need I to say, understand. Yolanda, how she need to say? When I was a child, Ada, when I was a child, I went visit to my father. Home or house. Or house. Uh -huh. mm -hmm. In San Miguel. In San Miguel. Mm -hmm. This is the way that you can say Ada. Mm -hmm. And the third question for all of us, it says, what did you, no, what did you enjoy when you were a child? Mm -hmm. How do you say jugar en la calle? <laughs> ah, to play around with, the, with the, your friends. With the neighbors. Exactly. Because I was about to say the same for me. I enjoy to play. Yeah, I play, uh, play in a <laughs> When I was a child, I enjoyed the uh, run and a bicycle. Ah, awesome. And Ada? Bicycle and the jugar hule también. Okay, finish. It's me. Hmm? You're ready. Are you ready to get back? Yes. Ready. But okay. You... Okay. Heidi, ask me. Ask. Okay. Okay. Uh, what did you eat last Holy Week? 
Mm, the truth is that my family doesn't eat anything special at Hollywood. So we eat normally, but I enjoy that my neighbors give me hocotes and mangoes in honey. Okay. okay, and where did you used to go on vacations when you were a child? I go, go to see my grandmother in Aspen, Aspen most of my vacation there. Really enjoy, enjoy it. Eat and um, I had fun. Okay. And what did you enjoy when you were a child? Mm, I really like it playing play games with my uh, cousin and watching television. Uh, I also learned a test for reading. Oliver Twist being one of my favorite novels. Okay, and describe the last party you attended. The last party I was at was my cousin, cousin wedding, wedding, the wedding, serem, mm -hmm. wedding, the serem, ceremony, ceremony. Uh, Ceremony was short, pleasant, and fun. The cake was delicious. Mm. Okay. Finished. Finished. So we may get uh, back to the main session room. Yes? Okay. okay. Yes. Okay, so here we go. Now we're going to continue with the class, okay? After you were asking and answering information questions, we're going to go over the information questions that the book, the manual has for you. And here we go. Because now you have the antecedent. Okay, let's see. Information questions and short answers. What volunteer to read the questions? Okay. Who wants to read the questions? And the other classmate yeah. is going to answer. Okay. So who is going to read what? the questions? Okay, Carolina. Okay, okay. You are a volunteer. Thank you very much. So uh, information. Car Car Caroline, hold it. Carolina, you are going to ask the question to another partner and he or she is going to answer with the sentences that we have here, okay? So another volunteer to answer the questions, please. Me teacher. Me teacher. Okay, Karen, Karen, oh. you are going to answer, Karen. Okay. And Carolina is going to ask you, okay? Okay. okay. Begin, Caroline. Carolina. What do you bath? What do you bath? I bought a vacation package. I bought a vacation package. Where do you he fly to? He flew to another country. When, when do you bath? 
for the service? We pay for the service last month. When did they fit all the promos? They the found promotion. out about, about it on internet. Okay, very well. Thank you so much, girls. What did you buy? I bought a vacation package. Where did he fly to? He flew to another country. When did we pay for the service? We paid for the service last month. How did they find out that promotion? They found out about it on internet. Okay, so if you notice here in the information questions, all of them begin with WH information words. Yes? What, where, when, how. There are some others, but they are not here. So those are the kind of questions that we need to use in order to research information, in order to receive information from somebody else. And here in exercise number five, you are going to complete the email using prepositions of time. Later, we're going to compare the answers with the class. So what did you, how did you, why did you, where did you, who did you, okay? So let's read again. Complete the email using prepositions of time. Compare answers with a classmate. This exercise is associated to this email, yes? that we read the first part of the class. That's why I insisted that you have to practice reading, reading, and reading, okay? Do you have any question about the activity we are going to practice right now? Exercise five, questions? Preguntas sobre la actividad que vamos a realizar? No questions? No questions. Okay. Now I'm going to stop sharing the screen and we go to the breakout rooms. Here we go. Okay. Go to your groups. Pero completemos la envase, creo que va a completar con lo que también acabamos de hacer. So, what did you send the email for? Podría ser. No sé qué piensan. ¿O qué pueden poner ahí? What did you send the email? Send the email for. La primera. Yeah, and it's, it's the same. It's, it's uh, for the complaint. Uh huh. Okay. What did you okay. send the email for? Y como tenemos que estar pasado. Yeah. Send it to complain. Así es simple, va. Yes. Yes. I send it. To make a complaint, creo que tendría que ser ahí. I send it to make a complaint. I, I think it, was, it, it could be to make a complaint or it could be to complaint about the... About the... Uh -huh. flight? What I, think it, uh -huh. I think it's complaint about the trip. The flight, okay. Let's make it the trip. I send it to complain about... The trip, okay. Mm -hmm. and, and how did you keep on? 
atau how do you how do you how did you were your experience no esa sería no. how was how how, how did you Ese sería how was, pero aquí es how did you. Podría ser tal vez tomando en idea lo que dice Yolanda. How did you rate your the service? Or, uh -huh. Uh -huh, okay. How did mm -hmm. Sí, hasta ahí digo yo que sería más. Mm -hmm. la other company. La dos que dice How did you How did you How did you for resolve to traveling on the bus? No. Quiero ver. ¿Mm? Está preguntando, how do you do? ¿Cómo fue tu experiencia? Podemos preguntar ahí. ¿O cómo resolviste el viaje en el bus? También. Pues how do you? How do you? How do you? For a solver to travel on the bus. No. ¿Cómo fue tu? Ah, sí, va. How did? How did you? How did you for a solver to travel on the bus? Como de, de ejemplo lo estamos agarrando, pero no sé. How did you get? How did you, how did you for resolve to travel on the bus? No. Ah, está preguntando cómo fue, cómo resolvió el problema. Ajá, en el bus. Ajá. Cómo resolver el problema de Eh, del bus uh -huh. how did you solve the bus problem uh -huh. Uh -huh. and the answer would be no pude hacer uh -huh. nada <laughs> <laughs> I couldn't do anything <laughs> <laughs> hmm. And number three, with you, with you, why did you complain? Okay, mm -hmm. why did you? Complain. Why did you complain? What do you say? Why did you complain? Why did you complain? Porque no había aire, verdad? Uh -huh, because the bus that I was assigned in didn't have AC. Where did you? Where did you go? 
Hello. De que Hugo estaba hablando de que él eh, iba a escalar. No, pero más? estamos hablando de la, de la, de la queja, del complaint de los emails. O sea, en el que está en la página, como el que escribimos nosotros, estábamos escribiendo un complaint que tuvimos. Y bueno, pasamos en eso. ¿Qué podría preguntar ahí? Por ejemplo, algo relacionado al trip. ¿Where did you qué? No, no sabía decir qué. ¿Qué les parece? ¿Where did you buy the tickets? Ya. Yeah. ¿Where did you Why buy, buy the tickets? Why buy the tickets? Where did you buy the tickets? I bought them online or I bought them in. Oh. Ajá, porque te está preguntando, where did you, a dónde hiciste qué cosa? Pero aparte mm -hmm. de eso, ¿qué otra cosa podríamos poner? Where did you. Um, where did you go after Mexico? Because we are talking about the connection. Uh -huh. okay, in your example, we were talking about the connection. So maybe it could be, where did you go um, after, after Mexico? No, 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 hold on. No, because it says I lost my connection to Mexico. No. Entonces. Tickets, eh, where did you buy the tickets? ¿Eh? Where did you buy the tickets? Esa es lo que se pega. Yeah, no se otra. yeah Entonces, for the both examples. Uh -huh. yeah. Where did you buy the tickets? ¿A dónde compraste los tiquetes? Entonces, I bought them. Sí, le ponemos online. Yes, online yes. is the most common. Okay, I bought them online. Y para la última, no sé si Hugo quiere colaborarnos ahí. Who did you? Está Hugo ahí, no. No sé qué yes. es. But it's muted. Ah, ok. No sé ahí que, que también podemos. Who did you, Yolanda? Who, no sé. who, did you com, who, who did you complain about your trip? ¿Con quién te quejaste? Who did you complain about the trip? Uh -huh. About the trip. ¿Con yes. quién te quejaste? Who did you complain about the trip? Y ahí puede ser. I complained with the main office. Well, mm -hmm. yes. O con customer service, no sé, le pueden poner. O atención al cliente. Huh? Ah, pues, I complained with customer service. Ah, pues. Creo que ya las tenemos ahí. Yes. I complain with a customer service. With customer service, uh -huh. Customer service. Qué rápido pasó el tiempo. Uy, what time is it? Is 8.43 p.m. Oh, 43. 9.43. Not 8. 9.43. My goodness. 9.43. <laughs> My computer is crazy, you know. I'm trying to fix it after the restart and the update that Made today when I was about to get into the meeting, mm, some keys are not working. I don't know what's happening. Why? Why don't? Why don't do the exercise number six? Mm. Hello. Uh huh. Ah. Because I think you know.
Okay, let's get started. I need one student from each group in order to read the questions, only the questions, okay? To see if we have any coincidence in the uh, construction of the questions. So who is going to be representing uh, Liliana Melissa's group? Okay, please. Her, her. her. Herself. I thought you were Herself. saying me. I thought you were saying me. Okay, <laughs> me. Okay. So just the questions, right? Yes. My questions. Okay. First, what did you what did you send the email for? Number two, how did you rate the experience with Avianca. Number three, why did you choose that company? Number four, where did you buy tickets? And number five, um, who did you complain about the trip? Okay, so you built the questions based in the email that you constructed, right? Okay, great. Yeah. And now, thank you. In the other group, who is going to read the questions? Okay, Karen. Okay. Uh, number one, what did you what did you do last week? Number two, how did you how did you solve the boss problem? Three, why did you to come play? Four, where did you go? Five, who did you send the email to? Very well. Okay. Now we're going to go over exercise number six, which is the last one, I think. Okay. Congratulations. You did a good job. I was listening to you. That's why I don't ask you to answer because I was listening to your practice. And here we go. So uh, we're going to pretend that you receive a call. Okay, so let's follow the instructions in exercise number six. And here we go, because of the time. Let's go to the breakout rooms. Okay. You have to tell you have to tell a partner a call you have. You receive that call. Pretend the customer was very, very angry because of a bad service. So tell your partner all the questions you ask to find the solution. Okay. Okay. And that's it. Okay. The same conversation for all the group. Okay, all the members in the team. Okay, what's the nine question? So I guess yeah, really. we can do some of them because uh, they are a good example. Uh, how? Uh, so what? As far as I don't understand, is if we need to make a conversation or we need to explain how the situation was? I think- I think make a conversation. Make a conversation. I think it's make a conversation. Ah, okay. Liliana, you had some other questions, right? Because you've been working at that time with- With Milagro. Yes, I, the most common, I think is, do you feel satisfied with, your, with the customer service? Um, uh, what I like think in order to, to practice is that maybe uh -huh. you can just add your okay. question. Uh -huh. Because with Yolanda, okay. we've been practicing before this. Okay, okay, okay. May I have your attention? May I have your attention? Uh -huh. In exercise number six, the instruction is that you are going to pretend that you are colleagues, you are co-workers. 
but you are going to tell to your classmate, for example, uh, Ada, I have to tell you something. Oh, really? Yes, I received a call and a customer was really, really angry. Why? Because he or she received a bad service. Oh, really? And what was that about? And then you can use some of the questions and you can mix the ideas that Liliana uh, has. Yes? Okay. okay. We got it. Okay. But we need to practice in oh. there. Yeah, in, in pairs, obviously, yes. That's so, it. Liliana, go ahead with that. <laughs> and I will practice. Order. And are you satisfied with the product? Recuerdo. Yes. Yeah. American, nosotros hablamos de American supply. Hello, Fatima, Tom, and, and Next. Eso fue lo que pusimos la vez pasada nosotros, en el otro equipo. Mm -hmm. Hello, Fatima, to uh, Next, I creo que era. Um, Good night. Eh, en este caso, Pedro, digamos. Any tier product? What is a product? Y, y comienza a decir el, el uh, Google for Advanced Service. Sería ahí uh, comenzar a meter así cosas. De may, I, may, I, may I have your attention? The instruction in exercise six tells you that you are going to pretend that two of you are colleagues and you are going to tell your co-worker about a call that you received because a customer was really angry with a service or a product that he received. If I say, uh, hello, Caroline, hello, I have to tell you something, really, tell me. Yes, a customer called me and he was really, really angry. Why she's going to ask me? Because of a bad service that she received. Oh, really? Yeah. And I asked her, okay, what did she buy? And what did she say? She told me that she bought, okay? And you start associating. It is that you are going to, you are co-workers, you work for the same company and you received a call from a customer who is upset, really angry, okay? He's not satisfied either with a product or with a service. So that's it. You're going to describe the experience that you had with that customer on the phone, okay? Thank okay. you. Okay. Uh, okay. Uh, Ana Claudia, I, um, hmm? I'm going to write something. No, no, we just need to only only practice. Make the conversation, uh huh. But make the conversation in in, in our mind. Yeah. Like usually we talk with a, a colleague. For example, if I Yolanda, you know what happens to me with uh, the last call I received. What happened, Ana Claudia? Tell me. Uh, this customer uh, called, he was so angry and he said bad words to me because, oh, really? yes, because the equipment didn't arrive on time. Oh, really? And he says bad words? Yes, I cannot oh, repeat that. I can't believe <laughs> I can't believe you. <laughs> Please believe me. And yeah. you know what else uh, the customer said? He will send an email to my boss. Oh, really? But um, uh, what did you do? What did you say to, the, to, to calm the situation? Mm, I... I have no words to say. I just say, okay, you can send the email to my boss because I cannot treat the customer in the same way. <laughs> but but that's it will be so hard, right? Because your boss 
your boss is going to say, I don't know, things that if, that you can cause your war, right? I hope that maybe this experience, this customer's bad experience don't affect me. But what I, uh, what I did is I apologize with the customer okay. and offer a discount for his next purchase. Bye. And I guess, and I guess huh? your customer, and I guess your customer uh, was so happy, right? Yes, he was. Ah, okay, that's excellent. <laughs> it Bye, was Ana. excellent, Ana Claudia. <laughs> Thank you. You too. Bye, you Ada. Uh -huh. uh, Ada, hello. Ada. Ada. She went. She went. Maybe you. Ada. Uh, hello. She is. She is. She is. She is. What? I don't know. No, you just need to leave. Follow up the conversation Liliana is saying because we are practicing the usage of these or the past, the, the verse in past. That is what we are practicing. It's a short conversation. Ah, it's a short conversation. Don't be afraid. Go ahead. Yeah. Take it easy. Take it easy. Mm -hmm. So, Ada. Uh, en realidad, acabo de conectarme y, y no, no he leído nada de lo que han estado revisando. Mm. O sea, sí. yo acabo de, de ingresar a la, a, la, a la sesión y no. Ok, okay. we're going to get back. Sorry, uh, sorry. She's coming from a surgery and, you know. Yes, okay, tired. but we appreciate, but we appreciate, yes, we appreciate that you are, you are in the session, okay? Thank you very much for joining. Now we're going to get back to the main session, okay? Okay, okay. Yeah. Okay, so right now, as a golden touch, we're going to have a sharing from group to group, okay? So Liliana, Melissa, please tell your experience to Heidi. Okay. Okay, and she's going to- Heidi, follow I have to tell you about- oh. Okay, Heidi, hi, I, have, I have to tell you about- Hi. How was your day? I have to tell you a, a fine, not fine at all, because I have to attend a call with an angry customer. Really? Why was he angry? Yeah. Oh, because the, the equipment, it was wrong. It, it wasn't the equipment that he asked for. He received the wrong order? Yeah, oh, really? so he was very upset and, and screamed at me, yellow? No, scream at me. And also he said that he's gonna report me. Oh really, and what did you tell him? I just can apologize for the situation and, and try to calm him down, but it doesn't work. Oh, it really? didn't, it didn't work. And at the end, what did it happen? It didn't work. You replaced the product? I just apologize and yes, of course, but he was so upset that he said that it doesn't want it anymore. Well, that happens. Okay. Yeah. But you did a great Shame on me. <laughs> okay, good. Thank you very much for your work tonight. Okay. And 
I appreciate your attendance and your participation, especially like Ada, she was a little bit late, but because she was coming from her work and even though she is really tired, but she uh, joined the session and we appreciate that, okay? It is valuable. And also Hugo is at work and he was in the session and he was at the same time, you know, working. So we appreciate that. But also the rest of the students' attendance. It is valuable and we appreciate your attendance, people. Now I'm going to say your names for the third attendance. And here we go. Ada, Ada Susena. Present teacher. Thank you. Ana Claudia. Here, teacher. Uh, Andres, not here. Cesar Humberto. He said he couldn't make it. And Fatima. Here, teacher. Francis. Um, Freddy said he was going to be at work. Heidi. Here, teacher. Hugo. He's at work. Karen. Present. Thank you. Liliana Melissa. Present. Okay. Lorena was absent today. Milagros. Mauricio. Patricia. Sandra Caroline. Carolina. Sandra Carolina. Hi, 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 hi. Hi, hi. hello, hello. Hello, hello, hello. Monica Yesenia. Wendy was absent today. So hey, oh, chill. Okay. Okay. Yolanda Cristina. Present, present. Okay. Thank you very much for uh, your attendance. And I hope to see you tomorrow, Friday. And I'm going to report the situation, the issue that you told me about uh, the homework. Exercise 15. Okay. Exercise 15, uh, number two, right? Homework 15. Exercise two, yeah? That's what you told me, right? Okay, very good. Enjoy your dreams, relax, sweet dreams. Bye-bye, God bless you, okay? Bye-bye, teacher. Bye-bye, God bless you. Relax, bye, God bless you, thank you. Bye-bye.